Welcome, my dear students, to the second part of NAT64, DNS64 implementation lessons. In this part, we are going to install the DNS service in the Uponto server here in this workstation, okay, which is Uponto server. We are going to install the DNS. Actually, this is the server we have a workstation running on the oracle vm virtual box okay so we need to install the uh, we need first to download the uh, iso image for the uponto server and we need to install it okay so the workstation the uponto server workstation is running now on the Oracle VM virtual box. These are the steps that we are going to uh, follow to install the domain name, which is learning ibv6.local. First step is to set the host name, the appropriate host name. We, the host name that we already set is DNS64, as you see here. If you want to change it, you can use uh, this command host name ctl set hyphen host name. Then you need to specify the host name. After that, uh, you need to update the A apt repository, and uh, the this update will be done by executing this command sodo apt hyphen get update after that you need to install the bind service bind 9 service is the uh, dns services that we are going to use to apply the server as the as a dns server actually bind or bind 9 is an open source implementation of dns available for almost all Linux distribution. Bind is a shortcut for Berkeley Internet Name Domain. It allows us to publish DNS information on Internet as well as allows us to resolve DNS queries for the users. To install the Bind9, you need to execute this command sodo apt get install bind 9 and bind 9 utils bind 9 hyphen duck and dns utils after you install the bind 9 and update the abt and set the, your dns server name now you need to uh, do some configuration for some files the first file that we are going to configure it interfaces so you need to open the interfaces file by using etc sorry sodo nano etc network interfaces and you need to set these options to set a static IPv6 address for your server. Here, the IPv6 address that we are going to use is 2001 colon db8 colon ddaa colon 11 colon colon 2. And the net mask is 64 bit, and the default gateway is the uh, router. Okay, so this is you can you can say that this is uh, which to set a static ibv6 address for the server the next configuration file the main configuration for bind dn the bind dns server the main configuration file is stored in the bind directory inside the ets and it is named as named.config.local. You need to open it before sudo 
nano etc bind slash named dot conf dot local okay you need here to uh, define two zones one zone to the forward and the second zone is to the reverse okay in the first zone which is for the forward you just need to write zone then the zone name between uh, double quotation then you have to write in capital i n for internet then to to open a curly bracket and to write three instruction or two instruction this is optional actually to allow the automatic update you can erase it but you have to write the type which is master and the file name that will store the configuration for the forward queries and here we we put the name of the file is for dot learning ibv6 dot local and this file will be stored in the bind in the bind uh, directory inside the etc okay this is the first zone okay the second zone which is used for to uh, install the configuration of the reverse queries again you need to write a zone option then the zone name then in uh, for the internet then open a curly bracket to close the curly bracket and you have to write type master as in the first zone and to specify the file name that will store the configuration for the reverse queries okay here we we use the rev the name of rev dot learning ibv6 dot local file is stored inside bind directory inside the etc the most important thing that you have to consider is the name of the reverse zone you need to specify the interface part of the ibv6 of the of the server here as you remember the ibv6 server was like that for the server db uh, sorry 2001 db8 ddaa colon 11 colon colon 1 and the net mask is what is 64 so these this part is the interface part of the ibv6 that is assigned to the server if you put the original zeros you have to specify zero here and zero here and i'm going to delete the uh, host part so i will left with this one this is the what this is the interface part of the ibv6 that is assigned to the server so you need to specify it in the name but in reverse order and you have to put between each number a dot so i start with one one then zero zero this is one one zero zero then a a d d this is for the second for the second uh, you know part of the interface then eight d b and put the c zero then one zero zero one after you finish you have to write ibv6 dot arpa that is for the uh, step number five yes okay clear now in the uh, steps seven sorry six and seven you need to configure the forward zone file and the reverse zone file sudo nano etc bind for dot learning ibv6 dot local 
Okay, this is the uh, forward zone file. You need to specify here the DNS 64 dot learning IBV6 dot local. This is the name of the, the of the server, and this is your domain name. And here you need to write root dot DNS 64 learning IBV6 dot local dot. This is your domain name and the server name and this is the option for the serial refresh retry expire and native cache ttl after that you have to write two records two dns records here at in for the internet and as for name server and you you have to put your uh, dns server name with the uh, domain name the second record is at in and you have to write the type of the dns record which is quadruple a that means this is ibv6 record and you have to write the uh, ibv6 uh, address for the server after you put the two records you need to specify all the uh, uh, host inside the network if you see here we have this interface which is 2001db8ddaa11 uh, colon colon 3 this is for r2 and we have uh, colon colon 1 this is for uh, DHCV, uh, DHCB v6 uh, interface 01 and we have also for the DNS which is uh, colon colon 2 so you have to specify all these uh, interfaces this is for the server okay and I put the name of the server and internet IN then a quad quadruple A the type of the record then the ibv6 address for the dhcp as well i put the uh, the ibv6 address and for uh, nat64 which is this interface uh, then for the router okay that's all for the uh, forward.learning ibv6 local now let us go to our second file which is for the reverse zone file that is called rev.learningibv 6local so I'm going to open it okay just change this one to rev okay this is for the reverse zone file now you need to uh, specify the uh, name server info again you have to write to uh, dns record but uh, instead of but a quadruple a you have to write btr which is a shortcut for pointer okay after that you have to write reverse lookup for the domain for your domain name this is the host part of ibv6 address for the dns if you remember your ibv6 address assigned to the dns is uh, 2001db8ddaa colon 11 colon colon 2 this is the interface part and this is the what the host part so you need to write the host part the host part is written like that 0000, 0, 0, 0 colon 0000, 0, 0, 0 colon 0000, 0, 0, 0 colon 0002 you need to write it in 
reverse order again you you need to write it in the in a reverse order so you have to write two then uh, dot zero dot zero dot zero okay then i n for the in, uh, internet then btr for pointer and you have to write the name of the server for the dhcp6 the ibv6 address like that 2001 db8 dda 11 colon colon 1 so you need to write the host part in reverse order so i start with uh, 1 then dot zero dot zero dot zero for the r2 i did the same the three in reverse order okay now we configure the interface file and interfaces file and the main configuration and the forward uh, zone file and the reverse zone file if you want to uh, test your configuration you need to configure the resolve.conf file this file is stored in the etc uh, folder in etc directory so let us configure it nano sorry sodo nano etc resolve dot conf you need to specify the dns search option dns search search option which is your domain name which is learning ib v6 dot local and in the name server you need to specify the ibv6 address for your server 2001 db8 dda colon 11 colon colon 2 okay save and exit okay B because you configure you change the configuration of the bind 9 service so you need to restart it with this command and you need to check the status after you start the service that's all for the configuration of bind dns server in yoponto server thank you for watching and see you in next part